Hello friends, welcome back. In this video tutorial, we'll see about the volumes, snap search and create images from the snap search. Also, we'll see how the C2 volumes can be shifted from one availability zone to another. Also, we'll see how the C2 volumes can be moved from one region to another region. So before moving to the exercise, let's discuss about volume and snapshots. So volumes exist on EBS. It is a virtual hard disk. Volumes will always be in the same availability zone as the EC2 instance. That means the EC2 instance and the volumes cannot be kept in different availability zone. So once you create the EC2 instance, the volume should be kept in the same availability zone. So let's discuss about the snapshot. So snapshot exists on S3 and it is point in time copies of a volume. Okay. And uh, always snapshots are incremental. It means that only the blocks that have changed since last snapshot are moved to S3. First time snapshot always take some time to create. Okay. And uh, to create a snapshot for EBS volumes, that serve as the root devices, you should first stop the instance before taking the snapshot. However, you can take a snap of a running instance also. So let's see how we can uh, move the volumes from one region to another region or one availability zone to another availability zone. What needs to be done to move the volumes? Okay, so to move uh, an EC2 volume from one availability to uh, another availability zone, what you have to do? First, you have to take the snapshot of that volume and create image out of that. That is uh, AMI, Amazon Machine Image. Once you create that AMI, you have to use that AMI to create another EC2 instance, different availability zone. Okay, in that way, you can move the volume to another availability zone. Similarly, to move the EC2 uh, volume from one region to another region, first we have to take the snapshot and create image out of that and then copy that image from one region to another region and then create the EC2 instance from that AMI. Okay, so let's see in action. Here we can see our EC2 instance is running. Okay, just uh, get the IP address of this and uh, see if our web server is up or up and running. Okay, okay, we can see here our web server is running. Okay, and we are going to take the snapshot of this uh, volume and create new server out of that snapshot. Okay, so what we can do? Uh, just go and first create a snapshot. Uh, if you go and uh, select the volume in the elastic block store section, create the volume. And uh, once you click the volume here, you can select it and create snapshot out of that. Just to give a name, my web server snap. Name, snap, create snapshot. So the snapshot is now getting created. Okay, so if you go to the snapshot here, you can see here the snapshot is getting created and the status is pending. So it will take some time um, to get created. Okay, once it is created, we'll create the image out of that. So I'm pausing the video. Once it is up, I'll show you. Here we can see the status is completed. Okay, now what we can do, create image out of the snapshot here create image give a name to that so my web server image okay. Just copy and paste it here create. so now our image also gets created okay if you go to the MI here image in the image section you can see here our image is created and the status is available now okay so what we can do next, we can create the EC2 instance out of that image, okay. So EC2 dashboard, 
and let's create another instance launch instance go to the my ami section here you can see here the image is uh, my web server image select select fit here now we can add another availability zone to the ec2 instance okay so what we can do create uh, in the sub subnet section just select suppose i'm going to add uh, to this 1b availability zone okay select it add storage the tax name web server snaps and the configure security group select the uh, um, the existing security group or you can create a new security group preview and launch select the key pair so our instance is now launching so go and view instance so just um, hit refresh for some time the new instance will get created shortly here we can see our instance is up and running okay so new instances created out of the images what we had taken the snapshot from that existing ec2 volumes okay so just click on this ec2 instance get the ip and we will see if the same web server what was running in the existing ec2 instance is running or not okay just go and select paste it here okay here you can see the web server is up and running now we can see how we can move the ec2 volume from one uh, availability zone to another availability zone okay if you go to the ec2 section here and uh, see the ec2 instances you can see it here uh, the it, the first ec2 instance which uh, was there uh, it was availability zone was 1a and the second which we created and moved to availability zone 1b okay so same way you also uh, change the ec2 uh, change the ec2 instance uh, from one region to another region so how we can do it just go uh, to the section here um, like uh, first what we have to do First, you have to copy the image from the one region to another region. Okay, so what we can do is select the image, copy AMI. Okay, so and select the destination region. So our region was Mumbai, right? Uh, we created, uh, we had created the city instance, and the image was created in the Mumbai region. Okay, so what we have to do now. Uh, move this image to a different region suppose i'm going to select uh, asia pacific tokyo okay and uh, here my image my web server image i can give us tokyo okay and description you can give it as it is or you can uh, if you want you can encrypt or leave it just copy ami now if you go to the asia pacific tokyo region you can see the images created over there okay just click on asia pacific tokyo so in the tokyo region you can see the images getting created now we can create the ec2 instance in this tokyo region out of this image okay uh hope it is uh, clear and you understood clearly how you can move your c2 instance uh, volume from one availability zone to another availability zone and how we can move that volume to from one region to another region by creating the images amis okay and if you have any doubt or any concerns you can just uh, comment in the comment section below if you have not subscribed my channel please do subscribe you'll get notified when i add new videos on this topic okay thank you